and welcome back to this very exciting episode. What we're doing now is getting an alliance with Sean. So I waited just a few minutes now um, and then we could have like over 80 and that actually did the trick. So with 80, we can now finally get an alliance with Sean LaFortune. So let's do that. So we do have an alliance now with both pirates. That is the ultimate unholy alliance here right now with the pirates. And we only have one goal, and that is destroy the Admiral and then just, you know, rule the world as a triumvirate or something like that. Very nice. So we have my, our fleet here. It's in front of the Admiral. I haven't sent it there yet. And in the new world, we do have now protections here. That is full of protections. That is full of protections. And this is full of protections as well. That shouldn't be a problem. What I'm going to lose though is I'm going to lose a few ships on the trade routes. So, because I don't want that, I'm going to stop now all the trade routes in the new world. This is going to hurt my economy a bit, but I've got so many resources there, um, money-wise. I should be, I should be good, uh, be in a good position there. And what we also have is what I've also did is just get some weapons to build fresh. You know, having a defense here. I'm having a defense here in Alonso's demise. So that was just um, repetitive work there. So I didn't record it. And I can speed this whole thing up by just buying weapons from her. And because of our good relationship, I have very good prices on those cannons. And don't really need to pay that much. So we do have a nice defense here in New Catan. And also something here. So the last resort or the last island that I want to fortify is this one here. Hunt's demise. And here I'm going to build like four or five cannons. And that's really it then, you know. So we do have some defense then everywhere. And we can then start with our conquest. We have both alliances. That's very good. So here we're going to have a lot of battle. When Sean is also declaring war on the Admiral. Even though he's got lots of ships there. Look at that. He's really strong. I'm a bit scared. Because we've put a lot of work into this um, let's play. Into this game here and this is looking dramatic this is looking big um and i can barely support my fleet to be honest you know it it it's taking so much money up here um like thirteen thousand just the ships that's quite a lot of money that i have to pay for that right let's wait a second my cargo ship should be arriving Where is it? No, it's not there yet. I'm speeding this whole thing up a bit. There it's coming, I think. Yep, yeah, there's my cargo ship, African Queen. Very nice. Beautiful ship. Those cargo ships. And we've also got another ship of the line. I'm probably going to send it to my main fleet. Should be there on time. Very nice. Let's get those bricks. I think we'll need bricks, right? Yeah, bricks and some weapons. And let's build some harbor defenses here. And we can only do that after the patch, by the way. So we've invested... Uh, oh, what I can see now, I don't even have enough influence. We, we, we couldn't even get such a, a big defense here up uh, before the patch, you know. So what I need to do is I need to upgrade a few more engineers to investors. That'll give me more influence points. As we can see, 42. Very nice. And now I've got 60 influence points. Okay, and that's only possible after the patch. I could not even get half of that defense before it. Very nice. Um, and now we can build that. Cannon towers. Let's get a few of them here. Just in case the Admiral tries anything. Anything daring. Four of them should be enough. I'm happy with that. Um, what we're doing now is I'm going to send... No, actually... Oh yeah, I'm going to send it back to New Catan. Because what I want to do is, in case we get this island here, my ships will be badly damaged. A lot of them. And I want to get my resources there real quick to build a repair crane. And with that we can repair our fleet then, right away. And continue our onslaught. You know, take the other two islands that he's got here. They're rather small. That's not a big defense here. And this one's very small as well. So no challenge for my ships. And then I should have eradicated him from the old world. 
I'm not expecting much from him. Much resistance here. So I hope my plan is good to go then. Let's get those resources. So we need some bricks for the repair crane and steel beams. And I'm going to send this cargo ship here. And hope that it doesn't get attacked while my ships do their business, their dirty work. Right, the new ship of the line has arrived here now too. So I just wait now for my for the cargo liner. Because I don't want to risk it being attacked here in the ocean. And let's have one last check here. So the pirates are on our, our side. Right, let's get our ships into his harbor now. And of course, he doesn't ex uh, suspect anything, you know, just like that. That looks perfectly normal. It's just a sunny day, just a big fleet coming to your harbor. I just want to trade with him, honestly. There's nothing else that I want to do. It's just some trading. His main city. He's even got a bank there. Beautiful. I can't afford a bank yet. Resource wise. And there it's coming. Very nice. Going to take a while to move such a big fleet. My ship is ready as well. My cargo ship with the resources. And yeah. It's looking pretty good. I've got my defenses up everywhere. New Catan is um, being defended the most with cannon towers and with ships in here. Let's also build another ship of the line. Ah, let's build two of them. And... Right, everything here is settled. There's nothing else anymore. I've prepared quite a lot. He's not declaring war on us yet. We are on peace terms here. So, in ceasefire he couldn't declare war on me, but in peace he could do that anytime. So he should, he should suspect anything now. To be honest, so many ships coming into his um, influence area. Yeah, that's going to be quite the traffic jam here. But I really want to get them in there as close as possible. He's got a battle cruiser there, so I'm, I'm, I'm going to open fire before that one leaves. Because the battle cruiser should be going down first. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that's it. Looking good. We have our fleet positioned. In the new world, I've got all my cities, all my islands fortified. Let's send this clipper here back to the harbor. Otherwise, I'm going to lose it. And let's send this cargo ship here back to the harbor. I don't want to risk them. And this clipper is going to stay here as well. And that's it. Let's declare war on him. Never interrupt your enemy. And that's it. Fire has been opened. His first ships are being destroyed right away. That battle cruiser is going down. And now let's focus on the cannons first, since they do the most damage. The siege of Liquid has begun. It's going to be a hard battle. I'm going to lose some ships here. Another cannon tower down, down. That's looking good so far. Reinforcements are not coming at the moment. And my the pirate should also have declared war on him now. So let's have a look at that real quick. Yeah, look at that. Anne has declared war on him now too and is fighting him. Isn't that beautiful when that plan goes up? Very nice. All that work that we put into that. Getting our alliances up there. Getting our defenses up there. It really works. That is amazing. And look at that. As expected, he's sending his fleet now to the old world. And Anne is also going to attack him now, right? And in the new world, Sean should be right on him. And he is. Isn't that just absolutely amazing? Sean is now on him as well. And yeah. It seems pretty much won on this frontier. Though it's not over yet, of course. Where's my cargo ship? Let's get that one right here with the resources. So we've done everything here that we can, though it's not over yet, because there are some defenses up here. Okay. 
It wasn't that easy after all. There is a battle cruiser. But this is going to be um dirty now, so I'm going to leave my herd ships behind. For now. Where is his main fleet of battle cruisers? Oh, they're coming for me. Look at them. Let's stay here for now. Let's get my cargo liner right in there. There is battle cruisers coming. The first one. Oh, that's going to be. That's going to hurt a lot. Yeah, they're not daring to do that. Well, the pirate is also doing its job. Just hurting him where it can. Oh, yeah. His whole fleet is coming. And she gives us 22,000 coins. That's very generous of her. Doesn't matter. It's just some smaller ships that she's destroying there. Nothing important. We knew this, this war would hurt. Yeah, he's not attacking me. He's got... Those ships, they're very fast, so I could never catch up with them. What we can do, though, is we can slowly move our fleet this way. That is what I'm doing. I want to get his main fleet there. So let's get our fleet. That is a bit stupid now. Look at that. The island siege will end soon in 1 minute and 20 seconds because... <laughs> I can't I cannot attack anything. Yeah, why can I not attack anything? Because everything's down here. So I need to get to the other side there quickly. Let's edit the newspaper here real quick. It's a rather destroyed fleet though. Lots of damaged um ships that I'm going to lose. Let's I'm keeping this one here and I'm going to keep this one here, even though that could be a pr um a mistake. So if he decides now to, to hurt those ships, that's going to hurt me. But he's he's way too busy with the pirates. Where are his battle cruisers? There they are. Okay, he's defended the island against me, but that is not right. We are now going for this one here. And I'm now also attacking his defenses here. Very nice. The morale did not reset as far as I can see, so we're still good to go. It's white flag now. Please give up. Please do that soon. Ah, very nice. And we got Liquid. Oh, beautiful. Very nice. That is so perfect. What item? No items there in store. No loot, it seems. There is something. Let's take that. That's not much that we get out of here. But at least he's dead. Let's get our resources on Liquid. And then we, we are able to repair our ships here real quick. I don't know what this ship here is doing. Strategic Clipper. We can't attack that. Looking good, so we have no casualties in the old world yet. We are losing a bit, uh, a few trading ships, but that is not so dramatic, you know. We got the repair crane now up here, going to repair our ships. My fleet is now coming. Oh, there are a lot more goods here, swimming around. Depleted treasure chest. So, Admiral's chest that we just got there. There's still something here. Where is his main fleet? The pirates are attacking me, uh, defending me, and... Just working out so perfectly. Let's have a look at the new world. So, we haven't lost an island yet. That's good to know, because he moved all his... F oh. <laughs> well. 
He still got his main fleet here and he defeated Sean quite decisively. Oh my goodness. Yep, that is a big fleet though. And they're going to merge. Okay, let's get to the repair crane and I'm going to repair my ships there real quick. Can I build a second one? I can build a second one. So let's have two repair cranes here. And I'm also building more ships, of course. I can do that. I have four more ships here. So the goal now is to really destroy him in the old world. Totally get rid of him. But I'm really afraid of that fleet here now that is merging. I don't have the defenses for that. I'm going to send... No. Yeah, we need to watch this closely, what happens there. Ready the ropes. Oh, wait a second. Let's get our cargo ship over there. So my ships are being repaired now. Very nice. Second repair crane. That's going to take a few minutes. Uh, not that much, actually. I only got two ships that are really... Damaged. The rest is so okay -ish, I'd say. I'm curious to see, or I'm afraid to see what happens then. But look at those ships. Oh my goodness. People, what are you doing? It is hurtful to watch that. like a traffic accident you know you have to look you can't look away this really hurts that's the ship AI I could totally destroy them now if I would have ships close by okay but anyway he's going to yeah he's going to capture my islands here I think I'm going to lose them do I have some weapons left I've got 20 weapons left here. So at least one, we could at least get, um, I think, two more cannons here. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, I like the influence, okay. No problem, though. I'm just building them now. And once I have the influence, I'm just going to build them. Okay, my fleet is looking battle ready again. And I know I do have a negative balance, that's because some of my trade routes are not working at the moment. He's going for one of my smaller islands there. Let's go for his smaller island there. Yeah, I'm losing this one here. Look at that. Yeah, they're moving for... I think they're starting with my smaller islands now first. Or they're going for my big ones there. Oh my. No, they're going for Bew Castle. I can say goodbye to Bew Castle. <laughs> Let's get my, my clippers there out of the way. Yeah, I'm definitely going to lose that. Oh, he's not stupid. I gotta say that. My fleet is stupid though. That is stuck every single time. Okay. Attack number two. Are 
Very nice, that's the next island. And where's Bew Castle? Let's say goodbye to Bew Castle. Shall we do that? Oh, look at that. That is just brutal. I did not expect him to have such a huge fleet. This might this might actually end in defeat this game. Um doesn't matter, we're going for the for the end, you know? So either we win or we lose. Doesn't matter, I'm not going to reload an old save game. Let's go for the next island. We're still strong here. And I've lost Bew Castle now. And his fleet like is totally unchanged because of that, you know, nothing happened there. I need to slow down there a bit. Right, let's have two more towers here, even though it doesn't matter really much against such a huge fleet. Yeah, Bew Castle is gone. Um, my military is strong, it says, but I don't believe that. You know, he's got such a big fleet there. Oh my goodness. I hope it doesn't clash those two. Right. Where should I go next? There's his next island. Let's take it. Ship was destroyed. This is total war now. I mean, actually, Anno is not really about that, you know, but now that we're in the middle of it, we have to destroy the last opponent. Usually I'm always ending a game with opponents left. But this is extreme, right? So we are going to, to destroy everything that's in our path. Okay, so where's his defenses there? That's really small. So there's my fleet on its way to the next island. Well, let's see what happens in the new world. There's his fleet again. What's he doing now? Oh no, please don't try to get through that again. That would be too much fun. Oh, they're actually trying to squeeze through that. I don't believe that. <laughs> what the hell are they doing? Like, seriously, there's so much ocean here. I don't believe that. <laughs> that is too fun. I'm sorry, but just look at that. I, I should send this to the developers actually because it's impossible. I mean, look at that. So much ocean. <laughs> no way. Oh my goodness. Yeah, let's squeeze out of there, they think. Those stupid captains. Oh my goodness. Well, my ships have arrived here in the next harbor. We're going to take that, of course. I'm going to lose another ship there. It doesn't matter. I'm just rebuilding it. Or building another one. Very nice. Next island. Okay, and let's take the last island here. Oh, that's still 20 minutes on white flag. Doesn't matter. Um, oh, we got lots of items here. Let's wait there. I want to see what items we have there. Some dynamite. Some timber. Nothing dramatic yet. Mm, work clothes. Windows, that's nice. Oh, what's he attacking now? Vilfresh! Is he serious about this? Let's get my fleet over there. There they are. Yeah, he's just attacking my Fisher Huts though. Nothing serious. He couldn't take Vilfresh. Not with that small fleet there. And he can't build any new ships here, you know. So whatever ship gets destroyed, he can't rebuild that. There's no islands for him in the old world anymore. Yeah, he saw me. We are with the wind, but those ships are just way too fast. It's impossible to keep up. 
not anymore. And we still, yeah, this one we can't take. Let's see, we still have some items here. Reinforced concrete. Sales or oh, nothing too valuable though. Canned food. Okay, so his fleet is going for the old world as far as I can see that. Or is it going for La Isla? Oh my. It's going for the, the old world, I think. Oh, it's going to, to come to a big clash there. Or, what the hell is he doing? He's turning around. He's going for La Isla. I got good defenses here. And my cargo ships that I don't want to lose. Let's send them here. And they don't need to be grouped. Let's go individually. Right, so I'm going to lose La Isla next. But, anyway. He's got no strength here anymore. The pirates helped me quite a bit. That's his last island that we're going to uh, destroy once the white flag is away. And with that, well, we'll stop for now. And next episode we continue and see if it comes to the big clash. Stay tuned.